hiding your notification bar can be useful if you're trying to stop yourself from being distracted by notifications on your Android device. You can also use it if you're trying to, you know, keep your privacy private. Hey guys, welcome to Shoes Text. So there are many ways you can use to hide the notification bar on your Android device. And um, in today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to do it using the Nova Launcher. The Nova Launcher is a free app. There's a paid version for it, but for hiding your notification bar, you don't have to pay for the app. But if you want the full features of the app, then you can go ahead and pay for it. I've used the premium version of the app, but for this tutorial, I'll be using the free version. So I'll be sharing my screen with you guys so you can know how to use the app to hide your notification bar. All right, let's begin. Okay, so this is the app on the Play Store. No worries, I'll leave a link so you guys can just click on it and get here. As you can see, I already have it installed on my device, but for you guys, I'll uninstall it. Besides, the app is not even heavy, so I won't be losing a lot of data here. So when you get here, you're going to see the install button. You want to tap on it. I just give it a while to download. It's around six megabytes. All right, so after it's done downloading, you want to tap on open. And if you open it for the first time, this is what it's going to look like. You have all these options here, but don't worry, they are not scary. Um, as you can see over here, the app says, if you have a backup file, then restore it now. Well, I do have a backup. It has all my customizations. Plus, if you use it, the notification bar is also going to be gone. But um, if you guys want that, then if this video gets up to 50 likes, then I'll leave a link in the description that will have the backup file, as well as a video that will show you guys how you can use the backup file. But for this video, I'm just going to do everything from scratch. So you swipe all the way to the bottom and then you tap this check button. And after that, your phone will ask you to choose your default launcher. If this shows up, then you tap on Nova 7 and then tap always. If it doesn't show up, then head over to your phone settings by swiping your notification panel down and then tapping on the gear icon and then search for default. So give the phone a while if it's taking time to look for the results, but um, mine took around four seconds. So here where it says default home app, you want to tap on it and then make sure Nova 7 is selected so you can get this home screen. All right, so that's the first step. So the second step, you have to long press on any empty area of the screen and then you tap settings. Over here where it says look and feel, you want to tap on it. And then here where it says notification bar, you tap on this to deactivate it. As you can see, the notification bar is still visible, but if I go to the home screen, it disappears. Now, this only works when you're on the Nova interface. Like um, when you're checking all your apps, you see the notification panel is not visible unless I swipe down from the top and then it goes away. But if you open any other app on your device, let's say YouTube, well, the notification bar is going to be back. So like I said, this only works when you're on the home screen as well as when you are going through your apps. But um, opening any other app is going to display the notification bar like so. All right, so that's how you hide the notification bar on your Android device. But before you go, for those of you that are using this just because you don't want to see notifications or because you are trying to hide them, then you should watch this video that shows you guys how you can also hide notifications on your lock screen. By combining these two features, then your privacy is going to be top notch. Anyways, that's all for this video. Hope you found it helpful. If you have questions or video requests, you can leave them in the comments. And yeah, I'll be seeing you guys in the next video. Stay safe and bye bye.